I'm Jennifer from JJ's House. Today I'm going to give you the best tips for taking measurements to choose the perfect dress for any occasion. Before I start, let's review how to read the fractions of an inch on a tape measure. This is one inch. This is one eighth of an inch, one quarter of an inch, three eighths of an inch, a half of an inch, five eighths of an inch, three quarters of an inch, and seven eighths of an inch. If you prefer to measure in centimeters, let's review that too. This is one centimeter. This is 0.1 of a centimeter. This is 0.2 of a centimeter, 0.3 of a centimeter, 0.4, 0.5 or half of a centimeter, 0.6, 0.7, 0.8 and 0.9 of a centimeter. We can use this to help us when recording our measurements. Okay, let's begin measuring. Please have the following things to hand. A tape measure and a friend. If you're measuring alone, a full length mirror will be useful. Your natural body measurements will give you the best fitting dress. Secondly, wear tight fitted clothing and an unpadded bra to make sure your measurements are accurate. Please make sure to have your shoes off. When measuring, you can keep your index finger between you and the tape. Record from the very end of the metal tip. To ensure accuracy, you can take your measurements twice to make sure they are the same. Now, let's get started. Let's start with the bust measurement. This is different from your bra size. Take the tape and measure around your bust at the fullest point. Make sure the tape measure is level all the way around. Breathe naturally and stay relaxed. Remember to keep your index finger between you and the tape measure. Measure around the narrowest part of your waist at the natural waistline. If you're unsure where this is, you can simply bend to one side. There is usually a crease where you bend. It's often just below your rib cage. Don't hold your breath, just breathe normally. Remember to keep your index finger between you and the tape. Keep the tape measure parallel to the floor as you measure all the way around your torso. Stand naturally with your feet together. Measure around your hips at the fullest part of your bottom. If you're not sure where the fullest part is, you can measure a couple of times and simply record the maximum. Remember to keep your index finger between you and the tape and make sure the tape measure is level all the way around. To measure your height, stand barefoot with your feet together flat on the floor and your back against a wall. Hold a book or another flat object on the top of your head. Mark the bottom of the book where it meets the wall. Step away from the wall and measure from the mark to the floor. When taking this measurement, stand straight with your bare feet together. Measure from the center of your collarbone down to the floor and do not look down. When taking this measurement by yourself, 
Put zero on the tape to the floor and record the number by your collarbone in the mirror. Stand up straight and relax your shoulders. Find the bone at the top of each shoulder where your shoulder begins to curve down into your arm. Take the tape and measure from one point to the other. Measure across your back's natural curve. To measure your arm length, simply measure from your shoulder bone to your wrist. Please rotate your arm a little to find out where your shoulder bone meets your arm. From there, take the tape and measure downwards. Keep your arm loosely relaxed by your side. To take this measurement, please wrap the tape over the top of your shoulder. Here it is important to make sure the tape is not wrapped too tight. Keep it slightly loose. Now you have all the measurements you need for choosing your perfect dress. If you would like a standard size dress and you find you fall in between two sizes, we recommend choosing the size bigger. This makes it easier to alter if you need to. Please do get in contact with us via our Facebook or our website. On behalf of all of us at JJ's House, thank you for shopping with us. Your fashion, our passion. Goodbye.